Hi, this is Kevin Seitzer of Mac and Seitz Baseball. Today we're going to talk part two of the mental side of hitting in a game versus practice. And, and right now I want to focus on exactly what happens in hitters' minds in the game that can get them in trouble. A lot of times when hitters at higher levels are facing really good off-speed pitches, change-up, curveball, slide, or split, whatever those secondary pitches are that pitchers will throw, they can start getting too conscious of being fooled or not being fooled to where they end up late on their fastballs. The majority of pitches that a hitter's gonna see is gonna be a fastball. And it's easier to wait on something slower than the fastball than it is to catch up on an actual fastball. We call that being caught in between when you're worrying about hitting both. So we wanna have the hitter get on the fastball in the game, don't be late on the fastball. If you get fooled, you get fooled, that's part of it. But have that good approach, which will help you with your recognition and your timing to where you don't miss that fastball. And it'll still allow you to wait on that off speed, to let it break, let it travel, and try and hit it back up the middle, just like you do on the fastball but you don't want to find yourself reacting to strikes and reacting to fastballs. Get on the fastball, expect every pitch to be a strike right down the middle and don't miss it. Thanks for being with us at Mackensites Baseball.